Today I will be discussing the state of the year 2024 in film. It has been a very interesting one to say the least. I have only seen 10 new release movies thus far this year, but I plan on seeing at least 10 more before the year ends. Dune Part 2 is still going strong as my favorite movie of this year, albeit it's at a point where it's only by default. As there hasn't been too much competition, and I'm sure there will be more coming soon. While Sing Sing was certainly a wholesome look at trying to find a second chance in life, and Inside Out 2 is Pixar's best movie post Toy Story 4, neither one is saying all that much. Sing Sing was not able to make that much of a profit, although it is still considered Oscar bait, and Inside Out 2 is the highest grossing movie of this year, and it looks like it'll stay that way. I saw the TV glow was an interesting watch, but it felt like a drag despite being less than two hours long. However, since I saw it in theaters, the Plot and themes have grown on me. Civil War was an equally devastating look at both photojournalism and a hypothetical dystopian America, albeit one that doesn't reveal what caused its conflict in the first place, but Kirsten Dunst and Kaylee Spaney are outstanding in the movie. Kingdom of the Planet of the Apes was a fun time, and certainly sets up what will be, what will be an excellent continuation of the franchise that already started off strong with the first three movies. Furiosa and Mad Max Saga certainly lacked the great pace of Fury Road, but still had all the great action you'd expect, and a, and a lot more of its title character when she was a kid than I was expecting. It was still a fun time, albeit a lot more graphic than Fury Road as well. Thelma. Now this was a movie that could very well end up on my year-end top ten list. Smart tropes and hilarious dialogues are certainly what makes it shine. Deadpool and Wolverine certainly brings back a good deal of the magic that made the MCU so special, but not quite enough to save it fully going forward. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. A very fun time with an interesting finish for what it was. That's all I'll say, but I do recommend it. The movies I want to see that I miss in theaters are Challengers, The Ministry of Ungentlemanly Warfare, Monkey Man, The Fall Guy, and Alien Romulus. The movies I want to see not yet to be released are Megalopolis, Joker, Fulia Da, Honora, Night Bitch, Amelia Perez, The Brutalist, Conclave, Nosferatu, Saturday Night, and Gladiator 2. Well, that's all for the rest of 2024. It's a good year for movies. I'm Joe Till. Thank you for watching.